hi guys welcome back to my channel so today it's another unboxing of the birch box and this one is for January I'm trying to keep up I'm trying to keep up but I was too late with the last one uh, because of November but I'm not gonna get into that <laughs> so today I'm gonna be doing the unboxing for the January birch box this is the box if you're following my Instagram page you'll see that I actually posted it and um, well, posted the pictures or the items that I got and there wasn't really much of a I didn't put no smiley face or anything because I was a little bit disappointed it was a little lackluster but I'm still gonna tell you all about it because I should <laughs> so stay on keep watching and you'll see the contents of the box Oh, side note, if you'd like to see this look, it should be up before, well, no, it'll be up after this video. Alright, so for this month's Birch Box, as you saw earlier, this is the cover. Kind of cool, nothing really fancy, but yeah, this is the usual. I really do like their covers, as I've always told you. They're very creative and put together. So, the this is the card for the month. I'm not sure if you'll be able to see. Let me come close up. Right. This is the card, and it says, let's try this again. All right. Yeah. So the card says, find your happy. After a whirlwind holiday season, carve out some me time with this box of beauty treats. Here's to finding your happy place in the new year, no matter where it takes you. Yeah, kind of cool. I always like the little cards. The little notes are really nice. And as usual, a list of the samples on the back. So to start, the first thing I got in the box was the Air Repair Complexion Boosting Moisturizer. This moisturizer I love. Love. I got it once in the in an Ipsy bag. It's filled with antioxidants and humectants that moisturize a dry, stretched out complexion. Now the next item I got is the Arrow Boost Color Enhancing Lip Balm. This you've seen before. I got this a couple months back in my um, in another one of the boxes. Um, it's a lip balm, a color enhancing lip, enhancing lip balm. The other one I think it was clear, and this one is actually purple. This ultra hydrating formula magically adjusts to your lips pH to create a flattering deep pink hue that's unique to you. Now the other item I got, which I've also got before, but I think that one was actually a leave-in conditioner. Leave-in conditioner, yeah. This one is the Beauty Protector Protect and Volume Spray. The one I got before was actually a red one. But there's, they smell so good. They smell so good. Get a boost of volume and shine with this weightless mist. Along with major body, it will also provide a layer of protection against heat damage. Alright, so what I'm realizing with some of these sample boxes, because as I said, I had to research before even coming to try the birch box, um, leaving Ipsy, of course. Now, the boxes are actually really similar. The samples are technically the same that come into each bag. I think the only one that might have a slight difference is the one from Sephora. Is the one from Sephora because they give you high-end makeup stuff, higher-end makeup stuff, but the the um the samples are actually pretty much the same. Now this this is a Deuce, what is Deuce? Free matic eyeshadow. And this is from Deuce or Dow? No Deuce, Deuce, Deuce. One of those pronunciations work, but from this brand. <laughs> Um, this is an eyeshadow. I got something like this already as well from Ipsy. Alright, so last and certainly not least, I'm sure you're going to hear the very dry tone in my voice. It's this sample cologne called Tokyo Milk Light Awaken Within Perfume. Now this smells horrible. So to me, in my opinion, it smells horrible. So bad. 
I love scents that are fresh. I love vanilla scents. I love scents that smell like fresh bakery. This smells horrible. I don't want to compare it to anything because I'm going to just sound very horrible. My God, it sounds too bad. But it is strong and just not smelling nice at all. So this is the box for January. It's kind of cool. Apart from that air repair moisturizer, which I am in love with from before, this is just... Uh, and then that perfume is what set it off. It set it off real bad. It smells so not nice. I do not like the smell of it at all. But this is the box. I still gotta bring it to you. I still gotta let y'all know how it is. I still want to, not gotta, because I'm not being paid for this. So this is the box for Jerry. I hope you all got, you guys actually did enjoy it at least. And um, I'll see you all in the next box or with the next box. That's in February. Bye guys. Don't forget to subscribe, thumbs up, share, comment down below what you think. I'll see you all in the next one guys. Bye.